Yeah. So you can see the difference, Captain Blush. This is it. Yes. Friends, salute and welcome to Patricia's Brothers channel. The channel when we don't edit nothing. The channel when we are filming this, the most amazing hobby in the world, and that is flying RC planes. The channel, uh -huh, he said, when we don't edit nothing, <coughs> we just turn on the camera and whatever happens. Say. Yes. We are going during the daily, uh, daily what inspiration on this channel. Like. And of course, this is the channel where you can all feel at home. Now, of course, ah, yeah. The unboxings must be done. Eh? Now this is again a choice. Eh? Like clicking on the place. We are giving you the option. You have the option to check the unboxing video. Or you cannot. Eh? You can just wait and you will see the maiden flight with the plane. Eh? We can't just fly all the time because sometimes we have the bad weather, we have the wind, and sometimes even the planes deserve to be unboxed on the camera because you must see what you will get in the box and today is really such an opportunity that we must film this because we have something really, really special. First there was Tundra, then there was the Grand Tundra, and like in the some movie franchises, like I don't know, Star Wars or something, you get the stories and then at the end you go way to the back because you must see how it all started and because of that we have today a beautiful and sexy something that I think we will be really able to recommend to anybody beautiful iconic the bush plane I mean this in fact was what this was one of the first our bush planes on our channel like, yes the three years ago thunder, the wheels are perfect eh? you don't even need to have the good runway to fly this plane and today it is so special because it is called the prime tundra and now we're going back to the beginning the prime also means the beginning and that means that this can be recommended of course for the beginner pilots eh? yes hmm? all you because need you in the one box you no. have two versions. Now, I don't have to tell you that this plane will fly good because you have seen so many videos and this is really your everyday plane. Whenever you want to have fun, just put the Thunder in your car and have it. Eh? Now, the point today is that this is the upgraded versions because the previous ones, you can't exactly say that that is the beginner plane. It does have the flaps. It is a little... A little, I don't know, the stall plane, you must learn what it means stall, quick, short takeoffs and landings. That is not exactly for the beginners. If you want this plane to be for the beginner, then it needs something and that is the assist of the gyro. And this time they have put the gyro inside this plane. You have two options. You can just bind it uh, with, your, uh, with your radio because we all know that it will work with the orange spectrum and open tx radios and you have the second version you don't need to buy nothing you can buy just the tundra for the beginning and you already have inside the radio which we will show you today yes i will put it little like this of course i can show you the pictures here you can see the beautiful and sexy steward from hobby king <laughs> the man from hobby king who is also filming beautiful beautiful videos from hobby king Great guy, eh? and of course, on this side, I will show you the specification. So I don't have to tell you later, Captain Bosch. Yes. Now, I also, I will check because in the past they were working for free cell. Of course, it's still the same, the free cell. 1.2 meter wingspan, a perfect in every car, eh? You can see also that the weight is not too much and it will run on the beautiful and sexy free S batteries. Now, I was flying mine on 2200. I don't think that... I'm flying mine on 2700. Yeah, 2700 in the weight of 2200 battery. Because we have those Gensei's batteries. But uh, with those we have got the good CG. Now I think that also this one, but okay. It all depends on how you will get the CG on that plane. You can stack whatever battery you want inside. The point is that you will get the CG. What are you looking, Captain Blush? I can see your beautiful eyes searching this something from here. Easy for pilots. Yeah, of course it is. Eh? Fun for instructors. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course. Eh? This is not just for the beginners, but this one is meant for the beginner pilots so you can start to learn to fly because with the gyro assist, we all know what will happen with that. Now, oh. I will put the box here. Eh? And someday, Captain Blush, what? Eh? What? Hey, someday we will put hey, all our tundras on the video at once. Hey. 
I have one, you have one, I yeah. have the big one, yeah. and now we have this one, so that means we have four thunders. Can you imagine that we fly four thunders at the same time? Okay, enough. First, the short manual, all that you need is here, the important stuff, of course, the CG and the throws. All the rest, check the, the, the store. You will have the link, of course, below. Check it and you will see what you need there in the store, how to assemble the plane and I don't know what, hey, all this? kind of settings. Now Captain Lush wonders what that is, of course that is for the, uh, the, for the front shield I think, and the another stuff, do you know what that one is inside? Yes. I will tell you my friend, say. For the bottom. Yeah, because I have, do yeah, you know for what? I will tell you, I have exactly for the Tundra, you can buy the box on the servo, the box that opens and you can drop the candies or something if you're flying okay, on some meeting. <laughs> We, you know, in Slovenia, on that uh, meeting, air yeah. show that we have, they always use the Tundra with that box. So if, when there are children, they drop candies over the yes. children and, and chocolates and that. Eh? Of course, I also have that box. I have bought it. I have upstairs and maybe, hey, maybe for this time, uh, yeah, yeah. No, for this time, not because it has, oh, this one is with the radio. But I will set it on mine and you will see once how that box looks. Okay, enough? Enough, yes. Let's get to the first, first part, and that is, of course, the beautiful and sexy uh, supports for the wings. You also have the prop inside. I will show it all. Eh? I will just open it here quick. I don't want to open them, and this is one sick knife. Eh? Look at this. Eh? Yeah. This is nothing. Eh? Of course, let's check quick. Uh -huh. You also get, you have, of course, the prop. Look at this, beautiful and sexy. You get the screwdriver, and of course here you can see, look, the supports for the wings. Do you see this? Eh? Oh. Yeah, of course. Eh? Now here it will be that you will have two options in this plane. You will be able to have the wings secured with the bolts, or there is a second option like in the old days, if you are not secure pilot, if you will be the beginner pilot, it will be more advisable that you put yourself the wings on with the, with the rubber bands. The rubber, yeah, rubber bands, how do you call it? On this one? Yeah, of course, eh, with the rubber bands. So that means that if you will land silly on the side, you won't break the wing or something, the wing will just slide a little because the rubber bands will allow to do that. Eh? Now let's check out first the wings. Of course, like always, Beautiful and sexy. The servos already pre-installed. The wires all covered. Yes. The bone linkages and of course, connector. You can see it is the flap, and it's obvious that the second one is the around side. Oh. Of course, let's check the top. You can see here already uh -huh. that you have the construction for the bolts, and I can see right now. Do you see something? Huh? For towing? Because, yeah, yeah, for the, I think for the uh -huh. rubbers have to block because... Uh, no, the, the first one had a... No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, not the rubber. The first one has a hole so, so you can pull, push, uh, pull a plane. So you put... Is it? I think that, yes. Oh, no, way. And now you got me, eh? I'm prepared, eh? Uh -huh. Of course, the second thing is... Huh, I don't know what they say. I can't remember anymore from the from the assembling the first two. What they say? What should this be? Something. Uh, this Something. goes on the top. Ah. So you don't ruin the, uh, the, the ah. wing because of the yeah, rubber right. bands. Yeah, of course. Eh. Look Otherwise this, eh. you would broke the this. Yeah, you put this here and then you can put uh, this is one great touch. I mean, look at this. Eh. Ah, I think that this will have yeah, to be glued on. Huh? This yeah. will be glued on, yeah, yeah. of course, eh? And later, if you will decide to put the rubbers on, eh, I was just, eh, I must do this. Yes. Because they were thinking of the rubbers. Because otherwise, the rubbers were usually on the, on the balsa planes. And here, if you will eh, pull the rubber much, it will dent the foam. But with this, eh, you will have beautiful and sexy plane for years, eh? Mm -hmm. This is something, eh? Of course, let's check the wheels. 
Now all oh, yeah. yeah. I was just hoping, eh? The, these, do you know, tell the truth? Yeah. I like these tires more than the second generation, eh? Yeah, but I will tell you that I have in my hangar the second generation, two brand new golden ones with the soft rubber. Yeah, but, but I, yeah. I, I don't like it because it falls out of the rim, eh? Kobe King, really good job that you have put these wheels inside for the beginner pilots because really, those rubber ones, say, if you land crooked, they fell off the rim, say. <laughs> Uh, uh, it happened to me on the maiden flight, it fell off. But of course this one, and on this one I usually, I don't know, I have put it even a little CA around here, and that's it, eh? so yes. they don't get uh, wobbly inside. Beautiful wheels, of course, you can see here that with this wheel, say, ah, you can handle any kind of the runway. And now we come here, look at this, eh? and now we can see the rubbers, and this time, look, the bind plug, do you see this? Uh -huh. Usually you don't have the bind plug with this kind of plane, say. No. But now the Haitani takes. Screws for the wheels. They are following the, the, the flow with this plane, say. Because in this time, in HA, you must put something on the market available for the beginner pilots that they have the assist, eh? so they don't crash the plane on the maiden flight the first time because you lose the courage that day. You say, hey, but screw this hobby, eh? it cost me so much and I crash the plane on the maiden flight, I don't want to be in this hobby anymore. And that is why the gyro is here. But once you are trained, you don't need it anymore. Of course, you can see here the rubber, the wheel, and that's it. Eh? And of course, a few screws, because I don't think that there will be much assembly on this plane even. Eh? Oh. The beautiful and sexy. Landing aluminum gear. landing gear already prepared the the bolts yes the, the axle and I, I will even say that this stuff hey, this is really good packed I mean look at this hey. really good quality pack so the plane doesn't get hurt inside of course yes. I will save all this don't throw the boxes away if you have the plane that you don't need to glue nothing on it don't throw the box because you can store them during the weekend uh, the, the weekend winter, the winter back in the boxes let's check of course the horizontal stabilizer or the uh, what do you call this eh? the elevator the elevator we should call it the elevator of course you can already see inside here the the reinforcement yes and of course you can see here that uh, the back will go together i love this thing for the back slide in they just slide in and they do work great of yes. course loosen it a little and that's it eh? <laughs> wait, this wait 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 interesting guy Oh, what's this? Ah, of course. The yeah. cockpit. The cockpit, huh? Ah, now we will Are see. Are there two of them? Yes. Oh, yeah. This is for the this. camera, maybe? Yeah, yeah of course. This is absolutely. The FPV cockpit, eh? Yeah, of course. So you can put the servo on and you have the head tracking, eh? Oh. But this is something, eh? Now this is something because if you have the gyro in, you can switch in the gyro and you can really use this plane also as the FPV flying machine. Eh? Well, this is great. Eh? And that is why you have the option, if you will lose that one maybe, you can put then back this sticker and you can use this one or even after you put inside the servo. Yeah, of course, after you assemble yourself here the servo with the camera, you put the sticker on so it looks Camouflaged, eh? Yes. This is great, eh? Now this is something which was done here, eh? Now of course, now this time we will go a little different. We always save the fuselage for the last, but this time we will save the radio for the last, eh? Uh -huh. Because this time we have the thunder with the radio, and this is the first time. What's this? Huh? Don't break oh, nothing, yeah, eh? Sexy. Oh, just as we remember them. Mm -hmm. ah. Of course, I can still see underneath. Yes. You can get the floats. For this one, I have two floats now. Uh -huh. Wait, 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 wait. You can put the floats. Of course, here it will go the wheel. I was. You have the coolings. Look at this. The back is already pre-assembled. The bull linkage is already done for you. Yes. What? What are such important? I'm just searching if maybe uh, it must be some, some small thin what carbon bar must be somewhere here ah it, it, must, it, ah, it is here, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course because i was checking where is the carbon bar for the back of course it is in there and now let's check inside what this is say of course ah uh, like this say oh the magnets 
Oh, and look at this, eh? They have even put it shoulder inside. I will give it to you. Do you see? You can see the ESC. Yeah, and there is the gyro. Do you see it? Gyro or receiver? Yeah, or maybe a receiver with a gyro or something. Oh, I don't know. Eh? Uh -huh, 30 amp ESC? Yeah. I think that this has a gyro inside, eh? Yeah, it But there are two, eh? Hey, what's this, eh? I think that it is. Hey, a yes, look, the receiver is here. There are two boxes inside, you see? Yeah, of course it is, eh? Ah, no, no, this is, yeah, of course, eh? Yeah. Check this, look, look. Oh, look at this. Now you have the receiver. Uh huh. Look. Yes. Oh, the third energy receiver, do you see this, eh? Yes. The third energy receiver, and of course, all goes in the. Ah, this is then the gyro. This is the gyro. Because, like I have said, you can just ah, bind this. There is a button here. Or maybe not I'll the bind and fly, you can buy this, not nah, the this. plug and fly. Uh -huh. Yeah, of course, the plug and fly, I think. Let's check quick, eh? Hey, but this one... Hey. Aha, uh -huh, yeah, 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 plug and fly. You can stuck inside, it does come. I was saying the wrong thing. You don't bind it with the spectrum receiver, or I mean the orange or whatever you want. The option is, you have here the plug and fly with the radio already, the third digit radio, <coughs> or the second one, like all normal planes with the gyro, you can stuck inside whatever whatever receiver you have, and then the gyro is already installed in the plane. Okay, so we have solved but this. This one, this one Check is Check next. This plane is a bit different than the first one, eh? Is it? Yeah. The different. last one has a hatch here. So you put in the receiver, you open it here. Yeah, this one not because you have the gyro, so it must be close to the gyro. And of course you can see that they have also, they have put it inside here. Uh -huh. The velcro for the battery. Yeah. And they didn't still stick this ESC nowhere. They have just put the velcro on, uh -huh. put it the, the second uh, uh, side of the velcro, and then you will put it whenever it will be convenient for you. I mean, this is a sexy touch, eh? You can see here, of course, the motor. Look at this, eh? You can see, look, mm -hmm. inside, of course, the Aerostar motor. Let's check. Oh, I can see something. 66, ah, ah. yeah, 30 amp. Yeah, not just that. Do you see this, eh? What? With the reversing system. So that means that, again, you have here the option for the reverse. If you will go this, put it on the floats, Go in the river or something and be stuck in the bush. Eh? Yes. I mean, this is one sexiness. I mean, look at this. Eh? Huh? Look how beautiful this is. Eh? Now, this is really, really the first. I can recommend this as your first plane. And even more after we will dash this somewhere in the runway. I will put this back in now. Like this. I will cover it because. I must take you know what? I, I think it, that, that even the nose is smaller, narrower than the first one. I don't know. Yeah, it is slightly different. different. Yeah, but still, this is the prime tundra, and yes. now, of course, ah, here it is. Show Captain Bosch, mm -hmm. where you will have the radio. And now let's check this beauty. Because this radio will have on all that you need to start to learn to fly. Hey. You don't need to spend thousands of dollars for your first experience with the plane. This one, all in the box, is perfect. Eh? It's now, all what this. you need. Oh, <laughs> look, the Prime Tundra TX. Do you see this, eh? Yes. Ah. Let's check what the it has. Battery indicator. Oh, the battery indicator. This is good stuff, eh? Okay. Because flaps up, flaps. Nah. Oh, ah, no, this is flaps. Aha, uh -huh, three positions. Look. Yeah. Flaps up, mid, down. This is arm. This arm uh, probably the. Ah, the gyro, the gyro eh? Aha, uh -huh, of course. This? Arm, disarm. You have here ah uh, dual rates. Do you see? And the gyro mode. This is here. the gyro mode. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, gyro mode. Uh, One, two, three, and of course you have the maybe, dual rates. Maybe this is arm, disarm for that. Ah, uh, the reverse. Uh, nah, yeah. Oh, arm, disarm the throttle. Ah, uh -huh. uh, the throttle. Yeah, we yeah. will see. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, of course, but I think that, yeah, of course, arm disarm, eh? I think the throttle, or maybe arm disarm the gyro. But this is the, yeah, the gyro mode. Oh, I don't know. Of course, we will see that. The point is that we will see. Of course, you have here the trimmers. I don't know if they should be all down. No, no, no. We will see. I think that they should be all in the in middle. In the middle, yes. Of course, when we will assemble the plane, we will check where it goes and... Open the back. How many ah. batteries go inside? Pretty good, eh? Let's check quick. What you will need? Eight of them. Yeah. Eight batteries. Double A batteries. It, eh? That's it. Double A batteries. But really, the bought one. 
1.5 volts, say. Yes. And you have even hit for the trainer, do you see this, eh? Mm -hmm. yeah, that's it, eh? All that you need in one box. I mean, this is great, eh? Huh? Of course, Captain Blush will do the main flight with this one because I don't know. Oh, look at this, eh? Oh. Maybe you'll do it, eh? Maybe I will do it for the second time. No, 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 first one you will. Of course, the first one time you will fly it, but I can see that I can change this and I can put my bigger stick on and even this. Because uh -huh. it does have the hook, so I can put it on my beautiful and sexy Flying Tiger radio tray. I mean, this is it, my friends. Look at this thing. Ah, and now you have it. Eh? The great option for you if you want to get in this hobby, and even more if you don't have the perfect runway shortcut it or asphalt, or I don't know what. Eh? If you're living in the middle of nowhere, that's even better. Eh? Then this is the perfection for you. Eh? You don't have to worry who will come and just full throttle and what the hell. Of course, wait for the maiden flight. So you will see how we will set this radio. And after that, only the imagination is the limit here on this channel and in your life. Eh? Don't waste your time. Click on something quick. Eh? Who knows if you will be able to fly tomorrow. So you have the option today. Quick, quick, my friends, because this will be sold out pretty quickly. Eh? So this is it, eh? Yes. What to tell at the end? Eh, it looks like it should be, eh? It looks exactly like the Prime Tundra, the beginning of the era. Because I can imagine that this plane was first, and then later they were upgradable planes, and even bigger, the Grand Tundra, and I don't know what. And maybe I think it's time, Captain Bosch, what? That I clean my Grand Tundra, the dust off, put the receiver back in, and that we do some flight, huh, Captain Yeah, Bosch? why not, eh? Yeah, this is it, my friends, eh? Pilot Robert, Captain Blast, Riding of Slovenia, the beautiful and sexy brand new release from the Hobby King K, the Prime Tundra, the perfect first uh, plane that all that you need is in one box. Of course, you will need the battery and the charger, but radio, the plane, and all that is inside the box. And I can't wait to test this. Even the flaps, you will be even you will be even able to test the flaps say, on the beginner plane. But this is something. Because usually the beginner planes don't have the flaps, but this one does say. Eh? And that is what makes it so special. So this yes. is friends, we love you all of course say eh? expect more pretty soon and that's it. Eh? Good enough Captain Bosch. Yes. Look at quick! Because what? Nothing. This is it. Eh? We will think what to do after Captain Bosch will turn on the camera.